country's name, Scotland Street. In number 44, neighbours who share a roof and therefore a life. Each in their own way having the quacks that make their city what it is. A setting for a drama that seems just round the corner. A place where the unexpected is expected. Dominica MacDonald, an anthropologist, observer of others. She has a certain style because this, after all, is Edinburgh. A te danson, shall we? Why not, my dear, why not? If one cannot dance a tango in Edinburgh, I always say, then where can one? Apart from South America, which is a terrible way away. Safer to stay in Edinburgh, shall we? Bruce Anderson, so assured, so gorgeous, so tall, so rugby playing, so utterly pleased to be exactly who he is. And who would not be pleased to be Bruce? On girls he will his gifts bestow. The sideways glance, that special look, the rest you know. is ready for life and she hopes for love too though suitable men are remarkably few for Bruce she's afraid well he's stubbornly Bruce handsome and proud but really no use romance will arrive she's reasonably sure a ring on the bell a knock on the door more likely, perhaps, in the form of a text, asking her just what she plans to do next. <laughs> to be six. So tantalizingly close to seven, but still six. <gasps> and have a mother like Bertie's who insists on lessons in jazz and yoga and psychotherapy. When all one wants is to be a boy, to have a Swiss army penknife and a friend, to catch a fish, to go to Glasgow on a train and stay there, to do the things that any boy would wish to do. Life is so exciting. Or could be if it went for mother. My dear Dr. Fairburn, we really must chat about life and repression. 
and matters like that. My dear Irene Pollock, you're terribly right. It's all just so complex what happens at night. So lie back, dear Irene, and tell me your dreams. And I shall explain what all of it means. Therapy really is wonderful fun. <laughs> and somehow I feel that the fun's just begun. My dog, Cyril, is not an ordinary dog. He knows a lot that other dogs can only guess at. He drinks beer from a dish on the floor of the Cumberland Bar. He has a gold tooth, the only dog in Scotland to have one. He dreams of rabbits. He has a score to settle with certain cats, but he knows where they live. He loves me, his master. I am his world, and he is mine. Thank you.